Okay, this topic is again from R.3, Chapter R, Section 3, and is order of operations with whole numbers and exponents, the basic version. So here they want us to evaluate this. Remember the four steps to solving orders of operations. I'm going to show you the quickly I remember. So I remember G for groups, which was the parentheses, the brackets, so on and so forth. Then E for evaluate, and you evaluate exponents, fractions, square roots, absolute values, things like that. Um, three is multiply and divide, but I always put an arrow at the top to show me I'm going from left to right. And then the last step is add and subtract, going from left to right. So um, let's go ahead and start with this one. There are no grouping mechanisms, so I don't need to do step one. Um, there is something I need to evaluate here, so we're going to do that. 5 squared, 5 squared is 25. And then we're going to, I shouldn't cross that out, I should check it because that's the step we did. Um, multiply and divide, I do have to do this, so I get 75. And then finally I can add and subtract, and I get 81. Now the next problem if I do my steps here with the short notation, get a little bit faster at, at it as you go, and eventually you just do that in your head. So I do have a grouping mechanism, which I do need to work on first. Then I need to do my evaluating, so I get 25. There is no multiplying and dividing, so I finish with my adding and subtracting, and the answer is 28.